What's going on guys, me Dave from Nickar Films, I'm back with another episode of NHL. Today we're going against the Detroit Red Wings, and this team is stacked. And when I say stacked, I mean stacked, man. They have Datsuk, they have Zetterberg, they have Nyquist, they have Tatar, they have every fricker in the whole freaking ocean. I don't know what I'm saying. Right there, we're getting nice shots, so I'm glad. That's, that's, that's awesome. Um, who else do they have? Uh... God, 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 the, the, the guy who hip checks everyone. Oh my God, he's, he's drawing a blank, man. Oh my God, they have Green, though. Green. How am I forgetting his name? Are you kidding me? Am I that stupid? Right there, who's the... Ah, God dang, how am I forgetting his name? Seriously, I mean, he's, he's one of the best defensemen in the league. I mean, keep thinking of Lindholm. Get the frick out of my head, man. Uh, Cronwall, jeez, took me long enough. Um, yeah, so this team, <laughs> this team is stacked, and it is going to be tough. I mean, these guys are more stacked than the Montreal Canadiens. This is the most stacked team in the league. All right, I'm going to say that right now. If they, if this is their fault if they do not win. Larkin, uh, they have Larkin. They they just have everyone. It's just it's going to be literally freaking impossible to beat them, though we are at home, which is always good. In real life, the Bruins did win, and I'm like, whoa, wow. You, you know, the Bruins showing some life, you know, not going negative like the Eagles over there. Um... Right here, Char throws into the front that we almost freaking tip it in with Bergeron, but he gets his life destroyed by their defenseman. Um, I need to see closer to the screen so I can see their names because I increased the size of the ding, the 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 preview window, which I'm looking at while I'm recording this. Um, yeah, right here, Ryan Spooner. Oh man, he just he just the honey badger. I mean, he gets bit, poisonous venom, passes out, wakes up, and just keeps eating the snake. You know what? You ever seen that video? Type it, just type in the honey badger. Honey badger don't care. Right there, we get a trip and call. Because, you know, I like the football tackle people. I forgot which video game this was, and they do that to me. And I'm like, okay, okay, geez. You went out up in jail. Please just calm down, man. Right here, we just whip it around the back of the net. For some reason, Marshawn does not pick up the puck. And that is just annoying when that happens. It's just like, you're right there. You might as well just pick up the puck. You know, we're paying you enough money for you not to pick up the puck. Um, so we are losing one nothing. We have to, you know, we have to go right there. Excellent pass from Kevin Miller. Um, sarcasm is the greatest. Uh, right here, we circle around with Marshawn, who is, in fact, a lefty, so we circle around that way to get a nice uh, slap shot, which doesn't really do anything. Right there, the one timer, but it does not go in. I'm like, no. Terrible uh, choice right there. We just skate up with Irwin, do a nice back hit, and it's a save by the goalie. I, right now, I don't know who's in goal. Is it um, Mrazic? Is it, uh, God, what's his name? God, why am I? These people, they're, I, I'm just drawing blanks on everyone's name. I'm, geez, man, I'm, I'm sorry. It's, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, let's just call him Mirazic, all right? Because I think that's who played in real life. I, I honestly forget. Frick, man, I, I know his name. Why am I? Blah, sucks. Anyway, right here we skate it up with our offensive defenseman Tori Crew. And we just skate right in and right up the slot. That goes absolutely nowhere with five minutes remaining. And I'm like, all right, we cannot leave this period without, you know, scoring because I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a pretty upset guy, you know. Right there. We skate up the right side with a left-handed player. The smartness is not on my side today, as Brett Connolly is unable to get the puck as we're just trying to take away everything they're trying to do Zetterberg I saw I see the big name that starts with the Z it's gotta be Zetterberg oh crap oh, wait no that's not Zetterberg what the heck who the frick is that Zetterberg is 40 that guy's 41 maybe the one stands for the one timer that they're about to do on me I'm just kidding right here we skate up with uh, Ryan Spooner I forgot his name too and we get our lives destroyed sort of like Bergeron earlier except uh, Bergeron got a shot off at least or something I don't know uh, right here we're trying to skate back but look at him shadowing me man he's like he knows my moves before I know my moves and I, I can't stand when that happens right there <laughs> he came out of the freaking substitution uh, box well, I don't know why I called it that to so, like for, with some anger in his eyes I mean that kid must that guy must have been beaten or something like he must have been angry as they score on us right there, I'm not even going to acknowledge their goals because this is going to be a flat-out massacre. Right there, it is the end of the period, and they're up to nothing. I realize I keep saying right there, right here, right now. I keep saying that over and over again, and I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, it has been a 
pretty tough to get all of these uh, videos out on this channel. Oh my god, you want to do that to us, number 14? Really? Really? Is that Nyquiz or Tatar or both? Or I don't know, that's not an option. Someone asked you A, B, or C, and you say D, it is hilarious. Right there, Helm scores. I remember him because he's number 43 and he's small. I don't know why I remember that. Yeah, but like on a multiple choice question... Oh, man! Oh, this is where I turned into rookie, so that's not really impressive. Uh, actually, that I mean, that was pretty impressive one for, through both the defensemen that Jimmy Hayes. But yeah, but on, like, a PSSA or something, I don't know. Well, like, you know, the state test that you have to take every year, minus PSSA. Um, you know, they give you A, B, or C. Uh, most of the time, it's D. But I'm just saying, just this is just an example. You always want to say D. You know why? Because it makes them mad. It makes you realize that you don't give a crap and that they need to realize that. As we just... I mean... <laughs> Speaking of honey badgers, Story Krug just completely left his defensive position. Uh, though I am honestly considering moving uh, Tory Krug up to offense. You know, he's like the Brent Burns sort of, just like nine feet smaller. No offense. <laughs> but, you know, how awesome would that be, man? He's got a slap shot for days as we go across the front of the crease. Then we hit with Jimmeth Hayes, who has been playing beastly for us. He stepped up even better than Lucic. You know, I've never got to play with Lucic in... Uh, an NHL game in my life, and it is sort of sad, but, you know, actually, I, I, want, I sort of want to do when I play as Lucic, because I, want, I just want to see how good he is at fighting, I mean, want to get in a fight with someone, right here, Brad Marchand cuts to the front, but he forgot to bring the puck with him, come on, Brad, what the frick, man, again, we paid you too much money, as we're trying to hit the one timer, and, um, you know, if Donald Trump was president, I feel like there would be <clears throat> a lack of one timers, you know what I'm saying, lack of Juan time. Get it, get it. Okay. I'm sorry. Um, holy crap. We, we're just getting shots for days. Shots for days. We do a little bit of row, We do a little bit of power shot, and it doesn't go in. Um, I still can't think of that goalie's name. I've been subconsciously thinking about it this entire time. It sort of sucks. Uh, hold on a second. I'll be right back. Jimmy Howard was his name. How did I forget that? I knew it was something like that. For some reason, I was thinking of Kadobin. Like, what the frick? Kadobin was on the Hurricanes. Hurricane, not Hurricanes. And then he went over to the Anaheim Ducks right behind uh, uh, Frederick Anderson. Right? Right? Is that his name? Frederick Anderson? Something like that. I don't know. Um, right there. Like, we're just three times in a row. The third time is not the charm, by the way, as we're trying to throw shots in on goals. They're still winning 4 2, and it is a little bit frustrating. Um. We skated up here with Matt Boleski, but not Matt Bezaleski, Matt Boleski. And we're just firing shots left and right, and it's like a freaking gun range up in here back at World War II from the Japanese prison camps, you know what I'm saying? That was a great movie, by the way, uh, Unbroken. I That was a pretty good movie. Um, yeah, I recommend you watch it. That was like a whole year ago. I can't believe that was a year ago. That was insane. My God, it's almost Christmas. What the frick, man? I'm going to have to do a Christmas special. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, oh, Jimmy Howard slash Peter Mrazek wants to do his dirty like that. I see you're going to save everything from now on, you frick! As Jimmy Hayes powers a bomb, but it does not go in. And again, off these face-offs, man, we're just firing them like crazy. As now we skate up with Irwin up. And we're trying to get it down low. We're trying to do a little bit of a wraparound. We fire a shot. Oh, man, I wish I would have gone in so badly. That would have been so sweet. Um, two minutes left to go. We check one guy. The one guy gets wide open. We completely end his life. <laughs> I don't know how so I love doing that, man, but it's so, sort of angering sometimes. We get a nice breakaway goal right there with David Karechi. No, wait. Yeah, Karechi. That was a nice goal. But, um, yeah, just diving at their legs and just watching them just explode. I don't know what's so funny about that, but David Karechi strikes again. Even though he's not Irish, he's from the Czech Republic, right? Right, that name is Czechoslovakian. Um, that's not a uh, state. Oh my god, I'm retarded. It's not uh, a country anymore. As right here, we get it back to Karechi. It's just, he has an awesome name, man. Right there, it just gets batted out of the air. And that's been like the ninth time that it's just gone up in the air for some reason. And with about 20 seconds left to go, this is their final attack as he steps right up into the slot. But again, we just dive like a champion. Um, and we got a penalty for it. So now it is a 5 on 3. 4 or 5 seconds, and the rest of the. The, or some of the third period. That would suck if it was for the whole thing. But here we go. It is Datsuk versus Bergeron. We haven't really said Datsuk's name a lot. I think he scored, though. I, I don't really uh, remember that very... That well. Not that very well. That wouldn't make any sense. 
So, I'm running out of things to talk about. What should we talk about? Oh, yeah, how about the Patriots? <laughs> oh, my God. What a game. If you guys love sports, I know you're hockey fans watching this, but if if you just love sports in general, you like the general competition, go go watch somehow, illegally download it, go watch it off the NFL. I don't, I don't freaking know, but go watch the Patriots game again. I mean, that, that was the greatest game of all time. That was literally the greatest game of all time. That was nine times better than the Super Bowl. Uh, I don't I don't know why um, we're talking about that right now. Right now, it is actually first intermission in the San Jose Sharks game against the Bruins. And uh, Bruins are up. They did score on the power play. Brad Marchand, and I forget who scored the first goal. Oh, it was Tyler Randall. It was his third goal of the season. Nice job by Tyler Randall. Thanks, guy. Uh, you're doing better than half the freaking players on our team. Cough, cough. Kelly, cough, cough. Posture not. Oh, oh man. I have a cold or something. I'm just kidding. Um, they're injured, if you don't know. Um, yeah, but anyway, right here, two on or three on two, we just shut that the frick down and we just gun it down the ice because, again, I am retarded. And that goes for ice. And we just try to put a big hit on him right there. I didn't, I didn't make any sense. I just try to put a big hit. And we play it with Rask. We're playing aggressive now. It is tied, by the way, so I did move it back. Uh, up all, to all pro right there. Oh man, no one was in the way. And we, oh, 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 he didn't trip him, but he got rid of the puck. And that is exactly what I want to do every single time. As right here, Ryan Spooner. Oh man, a nice pass back. I haven't, that's the first time I ever did that. Pass between the legs. I always think about that you have to pass the puck in front of you, like the way your guy's facing. But you can pass it backwards. I just need to freaking realize that. Ha, ah, gosh, like Napoleon Dynamite. Right here, we're trying to go deep. Down the field, this is not a field, this is a rink, and we cannot get it with Jim with Hayes. As still tied 4-4, within the period is halfway over. It's been pretty balanced this period. Them getting shots, us getting shots is right there. Oh, man, we just need to have our defensemen in front of those shots. Shot, 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 shot. Right here, Jimmy Hayes, what an angle, and he hit it so hard. It ricocheted out of play as this is a basic wrist shot right there. Uh, again, backhand shot. I don't know why he's not at his forehand. That's just so annoying. Right here, we try to take away something, but he passes it to the slot, and we take that away with Christopher Kelly, and I thought he would be doing the cross thing, where he'd like have the momentum coming across the right, and then you know, maybe a pass back to the left as Kelly drives to the net. I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's I had it all in my head. It sounded so much better in my head than it did now. Nice defense right there, cutting off the pass. I knew they would uh, pass it. I didn't really, I didn't control that guy, but I think the Max Talbot, ooh, man, what a shot just goes high of the goal. Uh, line change, line change, line change. Made out of clay. Let us try and ready. Dreidel, we will play. I, it's, it's almost Jewish time. I mean, Hanukkah. Um, what's Kwanzaa again? Wait, what, I, seriously, what religion is Kwanzaa? I, I forget. Is that like, okay, I'm going to stop talking here. <laughs> anyway. Uh, yeah, big save by Rask. I actually don't know. I don't want to offend anyone by saying what I think it is. But, uh, actually leave it in the description below and act all offended so I can laugh in the comments and at you. Um, I'm just kidding. Again, right the- Oh, that was- uh, Okay, I'm gonna, <laughs> Okay, forget everything that I've said so far. Right here, eh, we just got defense for days. Defense for days! And that's right there. That's what I like to see. We block their shots. Um... Oh, 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 that was, that was a little intense. It's like the things from Jurassic Park. Oh, 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 the Velociraptors. By the way, if you guys don't know this, I'm a huge fan of Jurassic Park. I just saw uh, Jurassic World over the summer. That was the first Jurassic movie I ever saw. And then I went back and watched all three of the movies, and I, I love it. I don't know why it came up on the subject. Oh, yeah, because Black Ops 3 beat it. Uh, Jurassic World was the most entertaining, uh, most sold entertainment, piece of entertainment of all time, right, right? Black Ops 3 comes in here and just completely destroys it in three days. I'm like, what the frick, man? I didn't know Call of Duty was that popular. Everyone's saying it's dying, and I, you know, used to think it was true. Now it's like, it's like the golden age of Rome, but every golden age has to end, as Ghost 2 will probably be confirmed. God, I hate ghosts. Um, I do like Modern Warfare 3 though, and it's made by the same people. Although the mod, uh, the makers of the Modern Warfare series uh, went and left to Titanfall. Um, yeah, so uh, what am I talking about? Oh, yeah, Black Ops 3 beat Jurassic World. Why am I talking about that in the first place? Oh, yeah, it's because I said, oh, like the Jurassic World thing. Okay, anyway, 13 seconds left. I'm pretty much just going to spoil it here. Uh, they don't get anything, although that was a pretty good opportunity. Um, it's going to go into overtime. 
And let's see if we can win in overtime. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh man, Spooner just gets killed and goes headfirst into the wall. That's going to be the end of that. And now it's Datsu versus Bergeron again, as it says too early over my head. And I, sh I should probably take that off. Do you guys mind if that's there? Because I'm, again, I'm still new to the game. Like, I would take it off if I was more experienced, but like, I'm still trying to learn the controls, even though I never pay attention to that. I should take it off. Um, I got the basic idea of the game down. Uh, not all the deeks, though. I mean, most of the deeks. It's really not that hard once you just know the know one of them, and then the other ones are just the same thing. It's just putting the analog stick a different way. Uh, anyway, right here, it's a one-on-one -on -one attack because we're trying to come back from, uh, from the back check. So many backs, and I save by Tuka Rask. Yeah. Uh, I haven't heard a goalie's name uh, been chanted is do they just do that in Montreal like I've been watching a lot of Boston Bruins I, I have the NHL thing where I can watch all the Bruins games and I'm just wondering like is that only in Montreal and like Canada where they do that where they chant the goalie's name I don't know just leave it in the comments below because I, I just find that hilarious I don't know why it's just funny because the, the goalie must just be mortified. He's just in like, oh god. Uh, right here we run into each other. And we just lay down with Chara who takes up seven feet of the ice. Like seriously, if, if he played for the NFL. He could just be a running back and just dive. Every single play just dive. That'd be seven yards, seven yards, seven yards. Wait, no. He's seven feet tall. I'm, I'm retarded. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Oh man, it's been a long day. Um. Yeah, it is like 8 o'clock at night, and the Bruins game is probably back on after intermission. And we're going to get in a fight here, right? Right, right, right? Who is this? We got Bergeron. We got Bergeron. I wish I could fight with McQuaid, but of course. Oh, yeah, yeah, they have Danny DeKaiser. Because I remember his name because that's Danny in it. We're going against Patrice Bergeron, who I think has gotten in the most fights on this team, and he is the exact opposite of a fighter. He is more of like a, a technique. Uh, kind of shooter, scorer, big playmaker, awesome person guy. You know, he's not a fighter. Uh, leave that to McQuaid, Chara, and let uh, Marchand be the, not, I was going to say Parasite, be, be the, uh, the annoying one. Um, so, right here, uh, oh man, that was almost, that was almost the goal as no one was in the slot, but we carried it up the ice with Chara. Oh, what a terrible shot. Shot, 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 shot. Right here at 25 seconds left to go. We're going to force. We're going to try to force this. Oh, hold on. Let me, let, the cat got my tongue. I'm, I mean, what? My cat's outside my room. Um, it's 15 seconds left to go. Last attack for the whole game. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. It was you fire a shot with David Krejci who came in for Patrice Bergeron because Bergeron got that 5 uh, minute major fighting penalty and right here is the shootout this is epic guys last week we lost in the shootout right here Patrice Bergeron oh my god original 16 versus original 16 a huge day by Tuka Raz right here David Krejci that was sort of anticlimactic I forgot to edit that part right there I'm sorry uh, he's skating up as I saw a T. That must be Tatar. And he buries it. Shara, to keep us in the game, he scores. We need a huge save from Tuka Rask. And he comes up with it. Tori Krug for the game winning goal. It is saved by Howard Slash Brazic. And a huge save by Tuka Rask. Right here, Brad Marshall with the game on his shoulders. And he scores. What a goal by Brad Marsha! 